Well, this is uh, Friday morning before Paul's graduation party, and we're all busy getting ready. This is the table. Of course, it's not totally set yet. Just Glenn, he's dragging in the garbage cans. Mom and Dad are busy rolling meat. Well, because this thing gets set up the first start. We're having ham and cheese and all kinds of fruits. That Sharon's the coordinator here. She's cleaning up after my watermelon duty. <laughs> oh, she's taking a film for me. Well, I missed the doer of this one, but Glenn's making a banner here. You can hear the printer going. I can't seem to get focused. It does say, congratulations, Paul, on the computer screen. Thanks, Thanks Paul. Paul. Now try it again. Congratulations, congratulations Paul. Paul. Duation now. Oh, which Windex should I use? <laughs> <laughs> I want to chronicle the fact that I'm washing windows. <laughs> and this is all for so the, what reason? <laughs> for Paul's graduation? Oh no, I do it for any reason. <laughs> well, here we are. The banner, first banner is already printed. Glenn's going to take it off of here. How'd it turn out, Glenn? Well, I'd have to say that it looks pretty good. Maybe the font's a little small. We'll try another one. I think uh, we'll try something that will get the, all the letters about the same size as the mortarboard. How's that? That's good. Go to it. <coughs> you can't hear me on here, can Yeah, you? I can. Glenn's busy doing windows here. We're going to have a shiny place if I can get close enough to make him see me. <laughs> I think he just figured it out. <laughs> yeah, we can't get it to go. Okay, go. Here we sit in the <laughs> yeah. You gotta swap chairs. You gotta place your boat. Do we have now this is the chairs? decision about which okay. kind of chair we should buy, and, and Glenn and Graham are checking them out. Oh. oh. When Glenn sets in that one, he what thinks think it kind of sings. I, I, I'm sinking down. <laughs> what does that tell you, Glenn? The chair is strong. <laughs> oh, is that what it is? I, I don't know. You feel little ridges come through there when you feel yeah. underneath the chair. I don't know. Okay, today. Sharon, you sit here. Is Dad going to come, come on, too? Let's okay. Add a more to it. Now it's Sharon's turn. She's going to take an opinion about which chair we should... This one feels... <laughs> I like to sit straight. <laughs> See how far Sharon sinks into that other chair. <laughs> Holy cow. Oh, yes, it does. <laughs> wow, look at it. Look how they read. Bomb, well, your skin hangs out the bottom. <laughs> <laughs> you look at the side, they look funny. You're likely to have pleats. Well, do we have a decision? As well, Dad's coming out like to try it. Right. Here comes Dad, he's going to try this out too. We're filming this. <laughs> Dad, you want to try one? We're, we're placing our hold on which one we think is more comfortable. <coughs> I'm not on this, am I? Hope not. No. That's chewing away. <laughs> you can think better when you're eating. Yeah. How's lunch, Dad? <laughs> now try the other now one. Now try this one. Which chair do you like better? <laughs> Except I keep shaking from <laughs> laughing. You're gonna burn this up a lot. <laughs> <laughs> Which one do you think's better? Yeah, nice. Did you feel what happens when you sit on this one? It hangs through. When Glenn got up, all the straps were. We're hanging way down. Well, this is Saturday, isn't it? And yeah. uh, we're hanging banners for Paul's graduation party. Kind of came the wrong way with that one. Says, congratulations, Paul. And uh, 
Joel is on one end of this operation. Crooked. Look at that. You got it crooked. How could it be a crooked? There's only one shot in there so far. Well, you twist it. Go down a little bit. Go down a little bit. Go down just a skosh. Like that. Perfect. Maybe you better put one in the middle. There's a chance it might sag. If you put one in the bottom, it'll probably hold it in the bottom. Right? That's good. Well, I guess that does it. it. I'm doing. This banner is outside on the patio. The other one is downstairs. What's that? Crooked. getting very, very close to party time and this is the table with Paul's congratulations cake on it. <laughs> the flowers are from Donna. Oh my god. Oh, wow. Wow. Why do I screw this up? No, this is a test. This is a test. Paul's getting ready for his party. Spray that hair so it stays in place. Just about right. No! <laughs> you know, I might have to have you kneel down because I'd like to see the cake. Yeah, that's better. And then I can put the one, two, three. Really is on the floor. I about this party. I like that. It's time to get the robe on. Jesus is warm. <laughs> I'm like, just in the hot sun. We are going to take this fall along. I figure I'm going to be on good time. <laughs> The distinguished like graduate the heads for pick right there would be easier. I like the white short socks. That's the best. Da, 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 <laughs> Where's the cat? Where's the cat? Shoot. Oh. <laughs> so up, Come on, let's oh see my. those legs. I like the socks, the too. The They're <laughs> real <laughs> cute. They're cute. Well, we're outside now trying to take some pictures, finding a shady spot where we all don't squint. And I went outside and Looks like Joel's about to fall off down in the woods. Well, I don't think this is the right spot. I think we have to go back upstairs. Hi, Dick. Joel just got ejected. He's not welcome on this picture. We should put two. Don't do that, Paul. Sit down. Joking around. Are you standing? Oh. One, two, three. Okay, Glenn, move in a little. Okay. There, I got gotcha. you. Okay. Congratulations, Paul. We're going to have to change where we stand. You sure you don't want to go back in the front yard? <laughs> oh, brother. Yeah. We have one missing, however. <laughs> Kurt hasn't <laughs> arrived yet. We don't, we don't want feet to yeah. that. That's oh, brother. Oh, yeah, that's oh, true. No. This is perilous to me. <laughs> Oh, Are you guys ready? He's good. All right, on three. Does this get One, two, three. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. They can go down. This is Sharon and Glenn's house, and it's the day of Paul's graduation party. And Glenn struggled and put up the banner this morning. It says, "Congrats, Grad."
Just arrived. Mother's Day flowers. Kurt. I brought dad old sweat socks. Oh, that's so cheap. Cool. Thank you. That's so cool. Cool. Oh, that's so cool. If you have got her, I'll try to let her have a wife. Dee, this is Linda Lund. Hi, Dee. Nice this is Don you. Price. Hi, Dee. Nice to meet you. And this is Kurt's grandfather. This is Vernon sitting down. Dee. Hello. Hi, nice to Dee. meet you. Nice to meet you. And this is my sister. <laughs> This is Paul's graduation, graduation poster showing his interest in high school. Headed to Winona State University. Oh, yeah, that's good. Yeah. Are you going to see the cake? Yeah. You want 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 to see the cake? Yeah. I don't know. How long have you been in the circle? Yeah. 17 years. Oh boy, you're getting close, aren't you? You're getting close. You figured out how to do it now, huh? Of course. I know you remember that. What does it look like? Uh, Tree already got this, but I figured out. Did I go over 30? Well, he'll say that. He'll say that. Okay. He'll say no. You know, Jen, uh, Sharon, uh, Tom Ryan being 20. And when they call a strike on it, and that's supposed to be. Uh, yeah, it's on it's, the plate, it's, it's supposed it's to be a ball. Ball. Yeah, it's they've, been they've been calling them strikes for the last couple of games. Oh. And finally, no, they had different one of those, we had food, so we decided. Out that, that hit the plate, huh? and the this girl has a tattoo on her. Are you now, doing tense? Is, if it hits Are you taking something? The triangle Looks like a dino. The plate, you know, it's got square and a triangle and back and it's a triangle portion. You can wave at him. So, it's so not only does the umpire have to call, what did, did it hit the plate? It's which part of the plate did it hit? Part That's good thinking. Yeah. yeah. Oh, I wish I used that to, up. You know, they used to have a plate. I thought this was really a good idea. It was just Tom Hosier's idea. They brought a plate with a piece of carpet well, attached yeah, to it oh, and it went behind. Yeah. And if it landed on that carpet, right. well, that's it was tough. a strike. But if it was laying on the plate, it was a ball. That's yeah. what he was if teaching the umpires. Yeah. Yeah. We have a green green carpet, too. But the thing is, Okay, here we go. Uh, yeah. There's yeah. Paul. There's Jenny. Say hi, Jenny. There's Pop. There. You can see Mrs. Kelsey. They just got here. There's Terry. There's Betty. Mr. Kelsey. There's Oh, focus, focus. Focus. Okay, away. Did we miss anybody? No, I think you got everybody. On the other side of Jan is somebody. I can't see this. Dad! Well, yeah, I think you should have been okay. I haven't seen him. And here we go. Bad, bad. The puppy. Where is the puppy? Outside. Eating. I don't see a puppy. That sounds like good. Get I get that house initiated. I told Wait. 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 Focus. Wait. Cool. I don't want to take it. Oh, there it is. Not as much as. Uh, it's bare. Maybe that's good. I got it. They had previous years. There's the woods. Okay, that's good. Right there on the screen. I kept okay. thinking about that. Bear. Best bear is the obedient bear. dog. Well, about as well as yeah. Bandit does. Yeah. Gnawing on that bush. Yeah. Um, but, it, but even before that, 
point. Well, 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 it's it's going going on I kept They're thinking, really why are we having all no, of no, this? But they felt no, the white, the white, uh, um, whatever it was, for sparkle there. Take care of the part right away. Yeah. 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 From a first marriage, yeah. one of them. But isn't there another yeah. California? Yeah. Yeah. You'll get that the next time you take her past yeah. your old yeah. one. Yeah. 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 Thank you. Yeah. Our canoe trips. What? What? I don't know what he's talking about. No, we didn't. It wasn't going on. Is that right? Yeah. Well, I got. I got to go on. First. I don't know where Dallas went. Hi, Jan. Hi, Dick. Hi. Say hi to Paul. It's for hey, him. Hi. <laughs> hey. Oh, I see it there. Yeah, that's why it's true. Yeah, right under there, Paul. Well, I suppose we'll see if you're a dripper now, Paul. Paul, you're a high school guy. Figure it out now. Fix that. Get some gum. What I figured out is probably the one on this end and this over there. <laughs> You're on keep track of. Well, everybody's gone home, and this is what remains of the cake. Flowers still look just as pretty as they did. Glenn's getting ready for KP. I'm getting ready for KP. Yeah. We don't want to see your butt. We're tired. Should I hear somebody say we were going to eat again? No, I'm going to eat again. That way, for posterity or posterity. Hi. Hi. I got a video tape. I think this little puppy thinks parties are time to be done with. Mm-hmm. This is Paul's bedroom, and you can read his sign. It's on his bedroom door. Well, here comes Kurt. We just arrived at his house. Front door here. Say hello or something. Hello. <laughs> Come on in. <laughs> I feel like Norm Abrams in this old house. <laughs> This is my kitchen. The bay window. Kitchen table. This is the tile that I put in. Comes out by the front door. And by the door to the garage. And over towards the dining room. There's the wood floor that I installed. See the corner of the vertical blinds and my grill out there on the deck. There's the carpet up the stairs into the living room. There's the three little openings between the living room and the dining room that you can see through. Kurt? You're fine. Here's my living room. Here's my view out the back. This is on the living room window. Can't see much out the back, but I've got 600 feet from the road straight back. Here's the bathroom. You see mom did the sponge painting on the walls. See, the tile on the walls stayed. We didn't do anything with that. The new vanity top. New sink. 
The mirror had to be raised and cut off a little bit on the bottom, so I installed the decorative tile between the mirror and the vanity top. Here's the bedroom. This is my new water bed. Nice closets. Yeah. Here's my messy walk in closet. Around the doors. Purposely cutting off the floor so you can't see all the dirty clothes. This is my view out of the bedroom window. There's my barn. My property line lies just on the other side of the barn. It's my horse pasture, or future horse pasture. You see my dog kennel and bandit lying there right by the, what will be the door as soon as it's completely finished. And if you look kind of kitty corner out the window, you can see straight back and you get the basic same view that you could see out of the living room. Okay, now you're going to have to bear with me and look at the potential of the room and not what's really there. This is my basement and there isn't a whole lot here right now. Uh, I'm going to give you a panoramic view and tell you what I like to do with the place. I'd like to put a fire place on that wall and then right in the center of the room here I'd like to have a pool table. The windows will stay the same. I kind of wish it was a walkout but it's not. There's nothing I can do about that. Here's my uh, my clothes hanging right now. It's the coax for the cable that comes through the house. It's kind of convenient to hang all my clothes on. This is not going to be my laundry facility. I'm standing in the middle of the living room. There will be a wall across there so you can't see the furnace or the laundry facility and that will be my laundry room and what I'd like to do is put a, a bar across here and it's easy I can I can pipe it in for water so I can have a wet bar and a refrigerator and stuff underneath. The dartboard that is on the wall where my fireplace will go I'd like to put right there. Back in the corner there uh, where what's left of Bandit's little daytime playpen uh, will be a bedroom. And this other door here is roughed in for a bathroom. And then underneath the stairs that go up into the living room I have storage space which uh, gives access to a crawl space that's underneath the rest of the house. Okay, what I'm doing here is just panning across the, the front of my lot. I'm standing in just across the street. See, there's the house. We just passed the barn. There's my mailbox. And my property line extends down to that power pole that you can see standing up over there and the lines run across the street. Okay, right now I'm standing between the barn and my house in a little access driveway that I can use to back my boat up. This is kind of a shot across my future horse pasture. And there's my dog kennel again with my dog standing there. And you can see the corner of the house. There's my garage. And here we've gone about 180 degrees. Okay, say hi to everybody. Or don't, just stand there and wag your tail. Okay, here I am standing up on Bandit's doghouse. This is a picture of my swamp. This time of year, this is about the only place I can really see it. If you look out the back windows of the house, all you see are trees. Uh, I own from the street 600 feet straight back, so that's twice as far as it was along the street line. I'm looking to the north. Here's Bandit again, if I can keep her in the picture. She's been locked up for a while here and she just wants to play. This is my backyard looking to the west, parallel with the house. The swamp is off to my right. Okay, this is the west side of the house, and you can see those, the concrete blocks there are the footings for my fireplace that someday I'd like to have downstairs. There's my deck. I'd hope to make that bigger this summer. I don't think it's going to happen. Maybe next summer I'll be able to do it. This 
is the yard off to the west of my house. I mowed the lawn today, but it's kind of hard to tell. It's mostly weeds. The soil's real sandy here, and not much will grow as far as grass. Okay, here I am standing out in the yard to the west of the house. Heading back towards the house. You can see my deck there. And there's the kitchen window. And the bay window in the garage. I'm looking east now. The street's off to my right. Okay, here I am standing on the other corner of my lot line on the street. Looking back towards the house. It's kind of covered by the trees now. All these scrub oaks that I have out in the front here, I'm going to trim back and thin some of them out so that they're not just brush, they'll be more like trees and hopefully they'll grow up a little bit taller. This concludes the guided video portion of our tour. If I look really hard in the fridge, I might be able to find a beer for everybody. See ya! Okay, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to run around and I'm going to shoot all my valuables. This is my stereo. I have my integrated amp on top, and the receiver, and the CD player, and the tape deck. Yeah. There's my speakers. Uh -huh. There's my TV I and VCR. My cordless telephone. Yeah. Yeah. Other stereo speakers. Here's, here's my gun cabinet. And from left to right, there's my air gun, my 30 out 6, 20 gauge single shot, and 12 pump. Here's my water bed. Here's my boom box. Okay, this is some of the stuff out in my garage. There's my lawnmower. Here's my mechanics tools. There's the jointer. There's my wood lathe. The chop saw. There's the jurors. My surface planer. The base that the chop saw is sitting on is our senior design project. The base from that is a half inch steel top with angle iron sides covered with sheet metal. I'm going to make that into a router table or a shaper. Here's my table saw, Delta Unisaw with a 52 inch unifence. Well, this is where we came to eat with the Krugers after we visited Kurt's house. It's called Two Guys from Italy. It's a neat little Italian restaurant. There's an outside place to eat, and then inside was real nice, too. Here stands the crew. Sharon's getting a picture of uh, the father and his three sons. Father's Day. Here we are lining up for a picture again. You got her doing that? Uh huh. Look at the curse looking back. <laughs> it says two guys from Italy, but this looks like five Swedes to me. <laughs> I have to click mine twice. Here we are, smiling. <laughs> And just to prove I'm here too. 